Hey there, my name is Craig. I am the architect guy. In this video, I'm going to show you how to insert an image into Bluebeam. So there's a couple different ways to do this. You can go up to the tools bar, select markup. Most of the way down, you'll see image. Click from a file. Your file explorer will open. Simply click the image and hit open. So now before I click, I have two different options. I can either click once and it'll bring the image in to its original resolution or if I click and drag I can file or I can size it however I want so I'll just click once and then I'll show you the other way to do this go to markup image from file I can insert it and then if I click and drag I can make it any size that I want so another way I can insert an image if I go over to the right hand side here I can select image from the toolbar and it'll bring in the same way and then I can also hit I on my keyboard and then I'll open up that same explorer and go through the same process so now once I've got my image in I have a few different options and things I can do with it up on my toolbar here I can do a few things I can change the line weight and that this is changing the outside border around the image I can change the color, change the type of line around it. I can also go over to the properties bar on the right, and those same options are there as long as, as well as a few others. Uh, I can change the opacity. I can crop the image right here. So to crop it, just click somewhere inside the image and then drag a box, and that'll crop out anything outside of the box. I can scroll down and resize my image. Just be careful when you do this, it doesn't lock. So make sure you keep that same ratio. I can rotate the image. And then if I right click, I can also do a couple more things in that dialog box as well. Uh, thanks for watching. My name is Craig. I'm the architect guy, and I will catch you next time.